chilly enough out there for you today? What's that? Chilly enough out there for you today? I kind of went Yeah, it's going to be 75 and rainy. This is th these are based on um, these are expense. This is like the, this is the from the, the expense lines from with the codes uh, that we use within the budget. Not like the uh, okay. it usually looks it, like. It, it's a little different. Okay. It is, right? Yeah, I prefer this other way too. No, I can't find it. All right, like this. Yeah, like that. But All right, that's okay. Tonight we have this one. That's okay. I can ask her for next time. We can print it out the other way. But it's the same. It looks. It, it, just, it leaves its grouping them together. That's fine. Yeah. Okay. So page four. So I would. So the executive office, which would be um, well, the first line of this mm -hmm. short-term interest payment, that uh, they're not in the same order as um, they would be. In the book either. In the book either. So that makes it a little difficult. But we'll work with what we have for tonight. So uh, the retirement system, uh, clearly we need to... Um, we have to know what the salary is going to be. Right. So well, that's, 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 not, hold. That's, that's something we would need to put on hold, right? Mm -hmm. Reimbursable expenses. Yeah, I need to ask her what that line is. So that's not a line that's in... Four one three zero three four. There it is. Reimbursable expenses. That is, um, uh, say, um, the car gets, uh, one of our um, cruisers gets hit. Yeah. Um, uh, we, pay out, we pay out of pocket for the, for the you know, the payers, yeah. the insurance company reimburses us. Unless we have this line here. Okay. We can't use the, um, the reimbursable funds that are coming in. A couple of years gotcha. ago we had, I think, every single one of our... Um, our fleet uh, from the highway department was in some sort of repair. So, and a cruiser that got rear rendered, I think, the year before that. Or Mike, I'm going to go get my, my book. It's in sure. my desk. Yeah, I'll be right back. So, that's why we have that line. Okay.
So it's gonna it's gonna be a little odd for tonight because we're going between this with yeah. the actuals and, and the book. <clears throat> I guess I'll have it printed out in this format. Uh, that's what I thought we were getting this week. That's so great. this is what showed up when I arrived. Most of them are self-explanatory some of them aren't. It's, uh, it is what it is. So um, I forget where it was. Original uh, reimbursable expenses. So I believe, if I recall correctly, we used the um, the dollar amount um, uh, the, the repairs from from that year, the highest year, uh, and used uh, just used an estimate based oh, off okay. of that. Okay. This, this was the first year that we had included it within the budget. Um, it was a recommendation by I think it was the municipal association. Okay. Um, and as you can see, we have. Uh, we budgeted fourteen thousand seven hundred, and up till last week we've uh, expended about sixty five hundred. So was that the cruiser? About forty five percent, huh? Was that the cruiser? I, I I don't know all the different reimbursable expenses we may have gotten oh, okay. from that. I have to ask Caroline, but um, clearly, clearly sort of a crapshoot. You don't really know. Mm -hmm. You don't. You really don't want to have to. The budget is too high because these are vehicles or, or other things that may be in disrepair and out of commission, right? Mm -hmm. Of course, if you don't budget accordingly, if you <clears throat> get a reimbursement and you haven't budgeted for it, you can't use it. So it goes, I mean, it goes into the fund balance. And it can't be used to offset taxes. There's nothing wrong with that. But if you're you know, trying to manage the budget, if you're counting on those funds, then yes, it is an issue. Um, we may be able to act more than likely be able to um, reduce that line. So I can make a note of that. I don't, we don't necessarily have to do it right now, but mm -hmm. I would like to ask her, get an accounting of all the things that have been under that line. Mm -hmm. I don't remember if that, if that is for police and highway and fire, or if um, it's just uh, if police had their problem. Like it must be all of them. Yeah. Double check. The highway is that one. It looks like it's for everybody. Mm -hmm. So. So we can consult also with uh, with the chiefs and uh, George and see what they think. But I've made a note at least to come back and revisit that line. Okay. Uh, supplies. It looks like they've. Um, what about regional oh, association? Oh, I just skipped that. I'm sorry. That's the um, um, strap of regional planning. Now, when are they expected to give us their dollar amount? Or is it the same always? It's, it's not always the same. It's typically very consistent. They just raised it last year, and they hadn't been raised in several years. So, so we, we should reach it? out to them okay. and see if there's going to be any change. But. Um, Supplies um, looks like they are pretty. Much, they've, they've spent that line. Um, there's a few more months to go. I'm not sure if they're buying, you know, toilet paper and that sort of thing ahead of time, or if they're gonna. Now is this that. everyone, or is this the executive office? It's just the executive office. That's just Caroline. Uh, it's the. No, so it's everyone. It's everyone in this building. In this building, okay. So you do do lump. Who buys the supplies, or do they all go on their own little thing and do it? Uh, Richard is, is coordinating now. They used to go off and buy on their own, so Richard is now coordinating for... Even paper and... No. Oh, 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 you're talking about uh, janitorial supplies. Well, so. Richard should do the janitorial supplies. Yes. But, like paper and, and um, writing utensils and all of those. I will check with Caroline to see if she's coordinating or not. Okay. I think she was, but I know Richard for sure. So you think the uh, rigid supplies, the custodial supplies, is under that as well? Yes. Okay. Uh, pretty sure. Unless, I don't think Until we come up to it, yeah. Okay. Pretty sure. Was, yeah. I guess. All right. Um, mileage. It does not look like um, we have come even close to it. Only is about eighteen percent so far this year. On mileage. Yeah, I'm not sure. Why? So, mileage, do they have mileage under highways as well? 
or uh, out on highway, um, well, highway, but I think transfer station too, because the attendants typically have to go to Concord for training. Let's see if they have mileage. Well, they have vehicle fuel. Yeah, but that's 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 for the vehicles. But right. would they? Well, would they take? The, the vehicle, so then that would be under vehicle fuel and, and not their own personal vehicle. They had been taking their personal vehicle. Oh, it was okay. cheaper than gassing up to you know, the, the the smallest of the of the fleet and sending them over, but that may no longer hold. Uh, true. So it doesn't look like it looks like it's their line here too. They don't use, um, they don't have their own separate line. So Spire would be vehicle fuel, I would assume, because they now have the command vehicle that they can take to, to right. do things. So I would imagine that that's where it is. So, yeah, we'd have to see if a uh, highway is part of this. Pretty sure they are. Okay. But it, it, may, it may be now that um, George uses, or... It's a big vehicle still to take out. Oh, I know. <laughs> I know. I, that one... Although he has a big vehicle himself, so yeah, I mean that's true too. But but he would get paid mileage with mm -hmm. the actual fuel consumption. So um, so we can hold off on that. Um, uh, Conference and dues. That's over because we used um, we used some of that line to that do the training. For the budget training? I think was so. one of them. Budget and um, CBA. Yeah. yeah. That's why. We used it from there. So, um, so all in, in reality, though, that this year might have been a bad... Although we, we talked about we should continue to have those trainings for the people, especially the new people. You know, if they can consolidate in one training, Right. In zoning and budget, or, or yeah. time wise, and just have them travel once. Yeah. If, but it may not even be the same people. Right. But yeah. it's something that we should try to maintain so our new people are as informed as oh, they possibly can no, be. No, I, I don't disagree. So. The, um, I was going to say, especially for zoning, but the budgeting laws change enough too that mm -hmm. they may warrant every single year. I don't see even, for sure. Even going up to like 600 We're instead of the 500. Might be a possibility. So the actual expenses so far are 676, 89. Yeah. So yeah. I, I would, uh, I would say you want to at least cover your actual expenses. So, but I will, uh, I will double check though, just to make, I'm, I'm almost 100 percent sure that's where the that line is over. But um, yeah. So there was a. Sorry, I'm sort of because it's not in the same order as another one. I'm sure that there's not a. Yeah, because the, 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 the planning training came out of, that we thought was, was being performed on gratis, um, it, it was taken out of um, planning consultants' line. So that should Oh, okay. Be, that didn't affect Oh, the, that the one. other one there, yeah. I just want to make sure I didn't miss it. I think it did come out of that line. Yeah, okay, there is another one. So it did come out of that line. So um, if we're going to, um, if we want to continue doing those trainings, I would say that we would probably want to bump it up to 700 because you want to at least cover your actual expenses. Okay. I mean, we could. I mean, if you don't have any new people, and then you wouldn't have to do it that year, but you don't know until after your budget's well, gone through. So. Even, even if you don't, but you can have the other laws trainings. change. So well, that's true, too. We want to yeah. make sure that everyone's on the same page. Mm -hmm. so. um, but yeah, we can see if it warrants it year to year, mm -hmm. I guess. But I think we should probably start getting into the habit. Of, uh, we ask people to volunteer, even if they're elected, and I get paid. I mean, they, mm -hmm. they should at least get the, the most uh, information that they need to do the job correctly. So, um, all right, contingency. Contingency is typically, is it 10% of the, of the overall budget? What it is typically, I think. Go back and look, what was our bottom line? I think that's what it is. So that won't, ch that, that will change depending on how much we can reduce or, or if we have to. Um, Not including, um, Capital, right? Correct. So the 
proposed was 1959,860. How much did we have? 17. 17, so it's a little less than 10%. Mm -hmm. Okay, so, well, that will be on hold until. Where we're headed, the IT hardware software services. Looks like we're right where we should be. Although, you, you saw Caroline's email about I new did. computers. Tom LaBell was suggesting that we need uh, some new computers. I think it's on here. Um, it? it was an email. It was. Not a, this. It's not. I'm seeing no. it in here No, before. she didn't. But I talked about it and I, and I said, well, yeah. you know, I think. We have to start planning ahead and start looking, and I think, I know we have to address the immediates, it was the assessing one, yeah. hers, and another one, right? What was the other one? I'm going to pull the email, oh, okay. I can't remember. But, but we definitely need to... Um, I'm thinking we should put it in CIP. We may need to, depending on... Um, well, and have it rotation, you know, like every five years, and if you don't need it, then you don't have to be the one that gets it, but you know, because... But we can include police, fire, and town administration as part of that. Because they, yeah. you know, so I'm thinking we should start planning ahead. Yeah, I agree with you. Most definitely. Assessing computer have not been functioning well for some time. Uh, it's already been, it was already a number of years old when I started here four and a half years ago, so it may be time for sure. Uh, because this is a critical function of the town, yeah, for sure. We need to be able to replace that one. Um, Tom suggests that we replace one computer every year so no computer will ever be more than five years old. We would also keep the expenditures even in the budget, therefore, assessing this year uh, one other computer. 2019. I'm open to your thoughts, but we need to be thinking of a plan. Raises a good point. So we um, should figure out who has the next oldest machine mm -hmm. in the building up here. I know that um, we can check in with Bob too. But I think we need to find out how many Mark. total we have. Yeah. Okay, let's see. Uh, okay, he Mark. has a, uh, there was a Chromebook that was bought a couple of years ago for, for highway use. Um, because of connect, uh, connectivity issues down in the, mm -hmm. at the highway department. Let's see. Okay. We had to buy one for the town clerk, I think, last year or the year before last because of um, updates uh, uh, through, uh, because of the, the DMV. DMV, stuff. that's so, what I thought too, yeah. And there were um, connection issues, um, and network issues, mm -hmm. they had to be upgraded because of that, but I think the state paper part of the upgrades, but, okay. All right, so I'll check in with her about that. Mm -hmm. um, Stuck here all day tomorrow. I'm losing a lot of my checklist down here. <laughs> all right. Office equipment and maintenance. Let's say we're about where we need to be. This um, this includes the um, printer, a copy or other. So the copy of the contract. So. Check what other mechanical equipment do they have? That There's a fax machine, but okay. I think I'm not sure if this new machine. Uh, has There's no fast do, cap capability. Yeah, yeah. If it's if it's networked that way, mm -hmm. I don't recall. So, but it's anything else. Any of the other office machinery, calculators, 
mm -hmm. like the actual like the ones that spell paper, not like the small things. Mm -hmm. Have to be under supplies. So. Things like that. Um, and obviously to repair those things if they need to be repaired. Title search and register of deeds. Let's see, we are in line. Let's have a little under a register of deeds. Um, we'll speak with the um, tax collector and see if she thinks that we need to change any of that. Um, advertising. Looks like we're in line. Um, should be, I would think, a little high because we've had to advertise uh, positions. a number of positions. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So. Um, printing and copy. That's where the, I'm sorry. So the office equipment and maintenance is not printing and copying us here. It's a different one. That's where the, uh, the um, copier contract falls under. So let me get a better accounting of um, office equipment and maintenance. And sure that could be the copier. This is printing and copying. This is your how much printing you're doing. Yeah, or you're sending it out. Is that printing your annual reports? That might be. Yeah. yeah. But isn't that under... Uh, uh, oh, see. I don't like where this is going. Printing, office equipment and maintenance, multifunction printer lease plus maintenance contract. That's what the office equipment maintenance is. Okay, yeah, I see that. Okay. So what do we printing have? and copying, 500 increase, 300 removed from budget committee communication line. What are we? I think that. So this is for printing, like the. I think it might be his copies books. The town reports, mm -hmm. the, the newsletter we send out. Yep. Um, we need to cover um, the stormwater stuff that we have, unless that's budgeted somewhere else. Mm -hmm. the stormwater, but. Okay, so that's what that covers. So it's so much easier to work off this without the actual notes in it. All right. Jump back to this thing. Um, advertising. I'm sure there's more lines. Anything here that... Postage is... Probably needs to go up because we still haven't mailed the next town tax bills. And it's... At 91% spent. Mm -hmm. It's go um, so those are going out if we continue to do that through that mail service, right? I don't know about that. Sorry. Where is that? Yeah, so when we sent out the first round, remember that we outsourced. I wasn't here. Yeah, you are. The first round of tax bills? Mm -hmm. It was? When was that? It was, yeah, but I don't know what that is. If I did was if I was here, I don't know what it is. It I heard it mentioned it something. What was it? Remember we? Um, I thought you were here. I was here. Yeah, I, I was, was here, here, but I don't know what what you what that is. I don't know. So what. at one time we would send out. They would get volunteers. They'd stuff the envelope. Yeah. Put the stamps on and mail them out yeah. from across the street or our yeah. local post office. Then they came up with the idea that it would be cheaper to outsource to a mail house and. Um, I remember that being done. Allenstown or something? I yeah. don't know where I went. But. So I, I'm assuming... But you I, still have to pay the postage, right? Yes, we do. So let me ask the... Um, I'll ask the town for tomorrow. Okay. Because, I mean, even if we still have to mail them yep. in December, yep. or, or whenever, yep. um, we're going to go over on that, I would assume. Like it. Postage yeah. also went up, so. Yeah. Um, so I think this needs to go up or something. I guess so. Okay. Payroll taxes are not accepted. Payroll taxes are not accepted. Alright, well, I better not about that. Postage. Let's go up. Next round of tax. Excel desk, the tax collector. Not the town clerk. Yeah. find out what the um, what it's costing us versus um, printing and postage here. Just send it out here. I'll keep 
that line for next year's budget, and also that. Uh, downstairs, if you go out the front door and around in the uh, to the right, oh, they're on the they're in the basement. Thank you. Yeah, sure. Um, the other thing we need to consider, and I should have raised this point when it came up the first time. I don't know why I didn't. What are we? What potential harm are we putting on our local post office by not sending out x amount of? pieces of mail going to that post office. Right, because so we, we need potentially could lose our post we office if we don't, if they don't, don't have activities. They don't, right, exactly. But I, mean, I guess the, the one po really positive thing is that the post office is um, delivering those parcels for, is it Amazon? One of those companies, right? So mm -hmm. that's increased traffic, which is a good thing. That means that our, mm -hmm. hopefully that our local post office stays in business. But yeah, I don't want to... The town must be responsible for the downfall of the local post. But I mean, it can't be that much. Uh, I mean, I don't know. Probably, no, but I was going to say it's probably a, it's a fair amount of work. But if you can get ten people to volunteer, you can do it probably in two hours. Yeah. And stamp it, one stamps it, one stuffs it, and one seals it. I mean, right. I think outsourcing, unless you're saving a, a whole lot of money, which I, I can't there understand. There may be issues with with print. I, I, we need we need to have. Like, um, Andrea, explain it again. I think it's Andrea, right? Um, because be, yeah. um, we're printing costs to that, so we don't have to go to. Uh, we used to do a the local person on summers work. Yeah. So we go to B and B printing. Yeah. Uh, Michelle would print them for us, and then we'd, we'd ship them back here, and then you know we'd stuff them. So this mailhouse is printing them there as well. So. Okay. Um, but just, I'm sure you're still paying for them. For sure. So yeah. I need to, I want, what I want to know is, is it worth, is it worth no longer now giving our 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 our, our, our work to a local printer? A local printer that, and, our and local the local post, post office. office versus what, what's the what's what are the we saving? Off? Right. What are we yeah, saving? Are we really saving a lot of money? And then you know, if we're not, I mean, then wouldn't we want to keep those? I think we'd want to keep it. Here. I, I'd rather keep the money in the local economy mm -hmm. than give it to no matter where I went, Allenstown or whatever town it was. I can't and if B and B isn't the best price one, I'm sure we can find someone right. or do at least a couple of right. quotes or something. Right. But um, I think that needs to be yeah. reevaluated. Yeah, I um, I think you would be hard pressed to find anyone who would give you a better deal than her. But yeah, yeah. I, I'm, yeah. I, I know I've used her for professionally for work as well for I've used like her last minute stuff. Yeah, yeah. And she was actually cheaper than going to Staples. So yeah, yeah. And I, didn't have to go to Staples, so kind of nice. Yeah. Um, okay. All right. So, but, okay. So postage, and we'll hold off on that. There's um, and printing and copying. I'm gonna ask about that as well. It sounded okay, I guess, when they first said it to us, but I, yeah, I would I'd like to read this again. Mm -hmm. okay. okay, so postage, we talk about payroll taxes. That will depend on clearly on payroll. So we're going to leave that there for now. Did that have something to do with the mistake that was made several years ago with a proper tax? Was it a tax? That, well, I know. Um, the uh, retirement the, system. The retirement system, it didn't have anything to do with taxes? There was, there was, I think it was a small piece was okay. went to that, but the, the bulk of it was, um, okay. was, it was the retirement system was the actual problem. We didn't, uh... We didn't take enough out. No, there were, there were two different rates and two different right. reporting periods for Group 1 and Group 2 of Maryland. Mm -hmm. We know now, so... Yeah, okay. Well, we didn't have the time, so... Telephone seems to be consistent. Yeah, that seems okay. But if we secretary, we'll hold off on that, and we'll see if I would, I would I would suggest we hold off on all the salaries. Mm -hmm. um, but it just I think the practice I mean, is that if you give a two percent raise to, to certain employees, 
could give it to people like this, which mm -hmm. is what we had done in the past. Mm -hmm. so that's what I, just told I mean, the, the secretary's position is at 42. However, your biggest time of the year is coming up, where the much more meetings. So. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. So it, I mean, it might be that it was a little under budgeted. It could be. You yeah. know, because you still have the biggest part of your year coming yeah, up. Yeah, for sure. Right. Yeah. yeah. No, who is this is the this would be um, the position that Salme is currently helping out with. Oh, that's Salme. Okay. And that's about halfway spent. Well, uh, that so should be okay. Yeah, because we're over half of our so year. Okay. Um, yeah, finance and admin secretary. That would be uh, that'd be Caroline. Oh, that's Caroline. How many elections are there next year? What is it, 2019? Mm -hmm. So there will be uh, town elections. Just town? Just, okay, so that's... Uh, but you have to now count... You have to count two um, deliberators. Right, so you have... Um, but you would have two town meetings, so that's... Right, so... No, do, do they have to go to... They have to be at the deliberative session. Only the deliberative, not vote. the other one, not the pub, not the hearings. I don't know. I don't think so. I don't think I don't they don't have think to so. be at the hearing, but they have to be at the deliberative because you have to vote, so you have right. to have a card. Right. Okay. I'm just seeing. Yeah, because we have. It should be less. Hearing, so. It should be less meetings. That's the point I was getting at. Because we have this one. Where I think tomorrow is in addition to what. You will have two deliberative sessions. Yep. Yeah. One for the school, one for the town. Yeah. Um, you will have um, town meeting yeah. for town election, so that's three. I don't think I'm missing Oh, that's one. right. They do the elections. Uh, yeah, that's funny. Those pesky elections, I get in the way. <laughs> um, uh, I, think that, I think it's only three, but I, right. will, I will consult. We added the two this year, right? This Tomorrow's in and number one. Yeah, yeah. So I think that's why. So could be reduced mm -hmm. by two, possibly. Mm -hmm. But so keep in mind, where are you looking? You're looking at supervisors the, the checklist. checklist. Mm -hmm. So they still have to meet the uh, they get paid for those meetings too? I don't know. What meetings? So they have to meet um, X amount of days before oh. the election. I don't think they do. I don't they think do, they but, do. But I, Someone will have to tell me that. I don't know. Moderator, so that's the one we should be. They, um, the moderator gets paid for um, election. elections, so that's why it's 180. So we'll consult there. How many elections? That'd be three. Three elections. So I'm just writing, making notes here. So three elections. Okay, we'll go back and we can change that. Might be a note right here. Actually, let's see. Ah, yeah. okay. So this past year, there were three supervisors at sixty dollars an election. There were three elections. So next year, there will be three elections. There was more than three of it. I'm three just saying what the yeah. note says here. So. Well, but one, two, town meeting. Three. And they had to be at the deliberative, right? Because that's an election. For the school. Oh, but that's school. That but no, school. is that different? Yeah. They don't do we, the school? We don't we don't budget for the school elections, so that's why. They paid them. Yeah, so we'll need to oh, budget okay. for it this year for, for the town one. You already budgeted for the town meeting, so it's just a replacement of... Yeah, so it's three elections this year and be three elections next year, so we don't need to change those. Okay. Lines. So okay. Just, that's why this book is better than this sheet. So. Mm -hmm. uh, select board, anticipate asking for mm -hmm. uh, for raises for the board of selectmen, are we? Our select board? Mm -hmm. That doesn't need to change. Now we're under elections and registrations. Voting booths, I haven't heard. Well, 
We're going to hold off on this one because the, the town clerk will make a recommendation. I'm following it? Yeah. Okay. Skip over election. I'm going to financial administration. Okay, so this one actually matches that. Of course, it's on the same order. Treasurer, also an elected official. I mean, is there a, a cry to raise the salary of elected officials? I don't think there is, but I mean, there could be a, there could be a, uh, depending on what we find out and what recommendations we make around. Um, town administration, like if there's going to be like a part-time town admin mm -hmm, or whatever, mm -hmm. uh, there could be a, a, a case to be made to reduce the salary of the select board, so they won't be responsible for as many things. So that's one thing I could think of. Uh, but so, where are we? Treasurer, so that's good. That one's okay. That one we don't have to change. Audit. I will check to see if there's going to be any change in the cost for the audit. And training. This must be for um, to send um, the, yeah. the, the treasurer to, um, the treasurer. to um, uh, the training. Just to add that municipal association for some payroll taxes. The tax collector too, because she's under there. Yeah, that must be it. That must be. So it must be the training for the tax collector, not for um, not for the treasurer. Um, and the the payroll taxes mm -hmm. covers, covers both. Mm -hmm. All right. So we'll hold off on tax collector salary, um, and then obviously the payroll taxes will. May or may not change there. Okay, reevaluation. Where are we? Planning. Where's planning? Alright, she would have cast a print this out the other way. Page 44. So I'm looking for planning and zoning. Following along in the book. Here. 45. Page 45. In the book. In here. Oh, where do you want it? I'm looking for it on this thing. Oh. On the sheet that she printed out for us. So I'm trying to find it here so I can follow along to see if there's any notes for that. Then. I think it was good. This isn't only the first meeting. Planning and zoning was on the first page that we worked on at the top. So it's cemeteries. Okay, at the top. Thank you. Planning and zoning. Planning secretary, okay, that, again, that's one we will hold. Um, yeah. And planning secretary. We will need to decide whether or not we want to um, retain the services of our current planning consultant or go in a different direction. Uh, so, Hold that. We can also, if we're going to stay with the same person, make sure that's going to be a sufficient amount. Mm -hmm. I can't imagine it wouldn't be, but the payroll taxes will just be a hold as well because we won't know until advertising. Advertising is, um, huh? Seems incredibly low. What's that? See how this could be right for advertising, but and ask Sarah to make sure that all the bills are going. Yeah, because it's both the planning board and the and zoning. 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 Alright, we'll put a hold on that one too. But that one doesn't seem like it's. It seems like the, the budget amount is fine, but they haven't used uh, typically the other way around. That's why I'm. I'm
concerned. Usually they've overspent the line, so. But is it, the advertising would be when they're having some kind of a hearing, right? Mm -hmm. Have they had any hearings this year? Oh, they have. We've had, uh, planning has had a few, and okay. that, they've, that they've had to send out to, um, to a Butters. And, oh, okay. Um, It may be that it wasn't that much, but I, I, that did, this doesn't seem right. So I, let me check with, well, Sarah does both of them. So uh, ambulance, we will not know until we check and see if we've got anything. Uh, Has anybody notified them? Because I didn't. I did internal here. Did you send them a notice about their budget is due at a certain time? The ambulance folks? Mm -hmm. No. Or just... Bobby or Mark do that? Mark usually uh, communicates with them, but okay. I'm going to note to check on next week's contract. Okay. Uh, well, a number of years ago, um, American Ambulance approached us and said they would do it for free. Mm -hmm. We um, were concerned about response times coming from they're coming from one the other side of some of the yeah. 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 But that would also save thirty two thousand dollars. But um, I think the prevailing wisdom at the time, and I'm not saying it was a bad idea, but I agreed with it, but was that uh, someone's life is certainly probably worth a lot more than thirty two thousand mm -hmm. dollars a year. So I, oh, I think one oh eight is too far. Yeah. I do too, but uh, yeah, I'm only willing to listen. Uh, I think we might have. I just close. Cemetery. I'm going to finish this page. Uh, cemeteries. We're going to wait to hear back from Mark and the rest of the trustees. But typically, there isn't much change. But a little bit here and there. Did but you notify Mark? Yep. Okay. I did. I did. Okay. Uh, right. Financial. We did. Reevaluation. I think we're, we should be good on all of these because we, um, I want to make sure that the amounts are still the same, but um, we did a, um, a renewal of the contract, contingent of um, funding from town meeting, but. With them? With Avatar, yeah. You last did? Year, yeah. Last year? I think it was last year, going into this year, going to, next, last year going into this year, yeah, we did. For the next five years? Yeah. Did you look at anybody else? Hmm. Well, I shouldn't say that. The, we, we did check with other communities that use other vendors, and they were no happier than <laughs> we were with ours. So. Okay. So. so we put a certain amount, a certain when percentage. When I say we, Suzanne checked, I didn't check, so. That's okay. But. Um, we put a certain percentage away each year. Is that what we do? For, uh, For reval? Yeah. It, is that under capital? Mm -hmm. So there's a fund that it goes into? Yeah. Which is why I don't like how she's done this. Yeah. It's a separate, um, separate one. I don't think about it. Because you put in money for the reevaluation. So what would this ten thousand be for? Oh, this is this year. I'm yeah. sorry. This is there's no lights on there. is the, the town reevaluation fund that will start rebuilding in 2019. So if you used it all, there was a, this, I just lost on the page again. Okay. Let me hold it and look back. I, oh, there it is. There are 
are two different things. So there's there's money that we put into um, into the fund, and then there's uh, there's money that comes out every year for other parts of the contract. And I, I, honestly, so at this moment, I don't remember. So we do it every is. five years, right? The the revaluation, yes. But there's um, and there's yearly updates. So every mm -hmm. time we do a they, they update the information from building permits into the assessing system, um, manage um, like the current use, all that stuff. So mm -hmm. there are still contractual costs that go along with that. Uh, the updating of the maps, that sort of thing. Um, updating the information system just to manage their access to their system so we can access our information, that sort of thing. So and then there's the money to put aside for the um, for the actual services. So she has it broken down into professional services slash legal expense. So let's see uh, So we we combined them. Mm -hmm. So that should be okay. You should take zero out there. Okay. And all together, I okay, this one at twenty. Oh yeah, I can put the kind of sure all along. What about halfway through? I wouldn't. Um, I personally wouldn't suggest lowering it. Um, no, but I'm, I'm wondering if you have enough with a few things right. that we have going. There are, there are so many, I can think of one that we could spend a lot more than what we've got budgeted for yep. to, to solve. Um, that's been going on for decades. Um, and every year I want to attack it and uh, priorities get shifted because they always do is like quicksand. Mm -hmm. standing on, you know, so. Um, yeah, well, we, we've spent about halfway through. Um, I'm going to go back and look at uh, um, our, our engineering costs. You know, there, there's always ongoing engineering costs for, for the culvert work that's never ending. Um, some of that could come out of the culvert fund, but I'm just going to cover the actual work. Mostly going to be legal, but there are some engineering. Let me um, let me sit down with Caroline also and see professional services for for engineering. We think we, we might have in the next year. We've made notes of that I just don't have in front of me. So professional services is something other than legal services. It's all it's, yeah. So it's it's legal, engineering, um, oh. all of that mm -hmm. falls under uh, professional um, services. It's typically the two largest are engineering and legal. Legal. Okay. Mostly legal is probably the most expensive. Yeah. But, but um, I mean, it all depends on 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 uh, on, on compliance issues. You know, how much do you want to deal with compliance issues? And we've got the ongoing issue of um, oh, this Clement Road that's never been resolved. Um, Summers there's road. Summers Road. I was just going to say the next big one. There's some unresolved issues on Summers Road. Rollins Road. Rollins Road. Yeah. 
Ramantra. Ramantra, though, seems to be getting a little better. It's a little activity going on it, it's but uh, it it's not where it should be right now. Right, but but there's some action on this, but that's because of the legal, the letters are out, I think, so. Yep. Um, still way beyond, but if you have to keep on sending a letter to do it, it costs money. It costs money. Yeah, so. I don't know. But yeah, let's put it on hold. But I don't think yeah. we're going to be able to reduce it the, no. there anyway. Right. Yeah. So we'll get there eventually. And I think I'm going to probably just stop there. Okay. I mean, this is just a quick overview, anyways, and then we'll mm -hmm. other stuff that we can that we have um, direct. Uh,